everyone, this is Unretired, and I am back with another Final Fantasy uh, Realm Reborn video. And I just want to discuss about um, crafting and gathering. Now, some of you that are new to the game, you're like, oh, where do, how do I start crafting? How do I start my gathering? Etc. 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 Well, the thing is, before you actually are able to do any crafting or gathering whatsoever, you need to finish your main class quest at your first city where you begin with. So, for if you're a Lancer, you're going to start off in Gridania, just as, such as I did. And once you finish your main, your, all your main quests, uh, your trainer will tell you, okay, you can start changing to other classes, or and you can start gathering also and doing your crafting. So this is a perfect opportunity to delve into the crafting and gathering uh, world, we'll just say. So, if you're wondering where, I'll just tell you where the locations are for crafting. Um, if you're in Limsa, Lominsa, uh, uh, you can do armor, blacksmith, and culinarian. If you wish to be a carpenter or leather worker, you need to be in Gridania. You need to go to Gridania. If you wish to be alchemist, goldsmith, or a weaver, you need to be going to Ulda. So these are are the three main cities to get your crafting. Now, every every crafting is unique in its own way, but they all intertwine uh, at some point or, or another. You know, one one crafting skill will need another crafting skill at some point. Okay, so just keep that in mind. You might have to pick up <laughs> most of them, anyways. Uh, you'll probably want to experience it and um, see how it is for yourself, right? So. If you choose to be an armor, uh, mining is your best bet for gathering. Um, blacksmith also mining, leather worker also mining. Okay, I'll explain afterwards. Goldsmith also mining. Now I'm just gonna finish through here. And if you want to be a botanist, well, uh, for gathering, well, botanist is good for culinarian. It is good for carpentry, a carpenter, excuse me, uh, alchemist, and weaver. And for fishing, which is a last gathering uh, profession, uh, that's good for culinarian, obviously, <laughs> and for uh, alchemist. So, why are these gathering skills? Why would I need mining for leatherwork or you know something like that? Well, when you're actually doing gathering, uh, you will be able to choose uh, different uh, different kinds of uh, uh, gathering materials. Um, so as of now, like I mean, I'm just doing carp I'm just doing uh, alchemist, and I am also a botanist. So, what am I? What, how the, how does this crafting world world work? Now, one little thing I have to add first is, if you have pre-ordered, you will have your Muggle hat. Okay, your Muggle hat right here, Muggle cap. Excuse me. So, up on. When you're below level 10, you gain 20% more experience. So put that hat on. Very important that you have it, okay? So you know you'll have your little uh, your little uh, weathered alembic for for me for if you're an alchemist. And after you do certain quests and all that, you will get gear. Now the gear in itself will have craftsmanship. That'll uh, plus craftsmanship, and we'll have control control points. This uh, intertwines with your quality of your items. Okay, so better the quality, the better the item. So let's just uh, take a look here. So if you want to go into your crafting, go right here in your personal logs, click on crafting log, and there you go. You can actually see the ones that you would have. I have only alchemy because that's what I'm starting off with. Um, and you'll be able to see like level one to five. And you go through it. Now it'll tell you the materials that you need to do that. So I would need one muddy water, or if I want to do this, I need two cinnabar. Now, once you get into other, um, like let's say this uh, growth formula alpha, uh, I'll need one quicksilver. So keep in mind that the late, the, the more, the further on you go with your crafting, you will need lower level materials or level le uh, lower level um, items that you create. So make sure you keep those things. You know, it's time consuming doing crafting. So if you just want to do crafting, 
go on ahead. I mean, it's if you don't want to be do questing and you're just waiting to go into a dungeon, especially if you're a DPS, if you're going into a dungeon queuing up with the duty finder, just do some crafting while you do it. I mean, it's it won't hurt. It'll help you out in the long run. So let's just give a quick example of how this works. Let's see here. So let's do some eye drops. So I need one rock salt and one yellow ginseng. So if you're doing crafting, please go to your area of your crafting skill and because you'll need a guild supplier. So I totally forgot what I needed already. Uh, ginseng and rock salt. So ginseng and rock salt. So we go here. Uh, one rock salt. We buy it like that. And ginseng. Yellow ginseng. Yeah. Excellent. Well, let's start it off. Okay, so you go back to your crafting. And we said we will do um, a eye drop. Okay, so you press synthesize. Now this is this crafting will go through the same process for every other crafting skill. Okay, you'll kneel down most likely and pull off something. Uh, as for me, it's alchemist. I'm pulling up this uh, alchemist station. Looks kind of dinky, but whatever. And uh, once you pull that up, you remember, guys. Just like, just like when you're leveling your main job class, your main jobs, your classes, um, when you're doing these professions, you still have skills also. So this is your basic synthesis skill as you, as you level up, obviously. Now, you know, this here, once again, increases quality. Now, I'm just leveling up, so it, I don't really care about the quality and whatnot. Uh, it does help to level up, depending on what item you're doing. If it's higher level than your actual level, which so I'm level 7, this is level 6, no problem at all. Um, this, if you're low, low on your uh, durability, so let's do here, for example, I press one here, so I did one. So one shot, it put my, it put my down my durability by 10 on 60. So let's say if I'm doing a high level item and I don't want to lose my durability, let's say I'm at 30, I'll just use this, Master's Men. Now it will use your control points. Don't forget that, okay? The more control points you have, the better it is, obviously. So just finish uh, this here, grab it here. Okay. okay, it went down again. It takes about three shots. And there you go, you synthesize three bottles of eye drops, right? So that, that's how crafting works, guys. It's very straightforward. You gain experience, um, and then you gain these skills. Now, Always read the skills, what they do, if it helps you out, if you're ready to put stuff in the auction house, please do so. There's a lot of higher people that are just mowing through the game and are going higher level will want to go into crafting and maybe they'll have lots of gel and they'll be like, screw that, I don't want to buy all these things, I don't want to go through all this, I'll just buy all the materials from the auction house. And there you go. Well, that's your opportunity as a lower level to make some cash. Alright, that's another little thing you can do here. Alright, so let's say here um, I need to um, I need to make a whispering maple wand. Alright, so I need two formula, two growth formulas. What do I need for two growth formulas? Alright, I need a shriek room, quicksilver, and rock salt. So I, you'll need to buy these. Uh, you need to buy these, obviously. You'll need to make two two of these. So two of these means four of this. Synthesize it you'll have two and you make two of those go through here and when it says here those little maple wands you have to select it see I don't have I don't have the material yet I did it yesterday uh, I tried it yesterday and it didn't work <laughs> but yes you'll have to you'll ask you to select and you put it in then you'll have the materials already it'll be written right here okay then you synthesize it now since it's a bit uh, one higher level than me I'll be using uh, master's men to actually do so, right? So guys, do remember that eventually everything's gonna intertwine your skills. I mean, all right. So do remember where the locations are. I'll put them in the description of the video. Um, and you know, have fun, guys. Explore, see how it is. If you don't like the crafting skill alchemist, we can always go for armor or blacksmith, culinarian, carpentry. Another worker, goldsmith, or weaver, and you have lots of options for you, lots to do in the game. So enjoy the crafting, guys. Remember, it's time-consuming. If you're queuing for a duty finder and you're DPS, <laughs> better do the crafting or some quests. 
Alright, this is Unretired, and I'll see you guys next time.